Hi and hello, this is Adina Pandian. In this video, we are going to see the important biomedical equipment, one of the best monitoring system in the biomedical equipment field, that is patient monitoring system. So what is patient monitoring system is nothing but uh, we get able to measure our vital parameters. Vital parameter is our blood pressure, our uh, uh, pulse rate, our respiration rate, our uh, ECG. So these are all the vital parameters in our given body. So all these parameters we can able to display in you know, one monitor it is called as a patient monitoring system. So in this video we are going to see what is patient monitoring system in the three main parts. That is in the part one we are going to see the parts of the patient monitoring system. In the part two we are going to see the part two video we are going to see the what are all the probes used in the patient monitoring system. And in the part three video we are going to see how this patient monitoring system operates and we can able to display what are all the parameters displayed over the monitor. So in this video we are going to see the part one that is parts of the patient monitoring system in detail. Come let's go to see the parts of the patient monitoring system. So this is the equipment called the patient monitoring system. Through this patient monitoring system only we can able to understand the vital parameters of our human body. This patient monitoring system size, this is the monitor and it having a size of around 12 inch monitor size, it is around. And then the front view we have the normal buttons, in the, in the bottom region we have the several buttons, this is a power card button. And this is the several buttons for the settings display and in the in near the power card button we have an AC power and the battery power and this is the further settings buttons. It is very important thing is the yellow button. The yellow button is very useful for reducing the noise in our atmosphere and then next buttons are used for several purpose like a freezing and the parameter display everything. And this particular knob, that is a third ash color knob is nothing but uh, your uh, settings buttons because of where our parameter go to display in the first row or second row or third row like that. We can able to adjust using this particular setting knob. This is the front view buttons of patient monitoring system. And uh, we are going to look the side view of the patient monitoring system now. So this is the side view of the patient monitoring system. Here only we can able to connect our probes. These are all the holes connected and through this only we can able to connect our uh, uh, probes here for uh, the first thing is for connecting our temperature probe through this. And the second thing is for connecting our blood pressure probe to this. And uh, the third thing is nothing but we can able to connect our ECG probe and the fourth thing is we can able to connect our SPO2 and here we can able to connect an NIPP. The two several buttons are there for further use. In the back side of the patient monitoring system we have the power card button here and the second thing is for the uh, this is power card button and uh, the second view is nothing but uh, we can able to connect this button and the second thing is nothing but a ground connection for the safety purpose and the third button is nothing but uh, we can able to send our data through the remote areas through this particular uh, a button and then uh, in the top view we have uh, two speakers suppose if the readings are abnormal then the patient monitor system give an alarm and uh, this is the side view front view on the back side view of uh, the patient monitoring system and it is very comfortable we can able to uh, lift over anywhere else this patient monitoring system it is around uh, 2.5 to 4 kg and uh, these are all the buttons and now I am going to uh, connect and uh, on the switch on the patient monitor system. We are able to connect the 230 volt connection and then give a long press of the power button in the patient monitoring system. Once you are giving a long press and then uh, your patient monitoring system will be on within a 2 seconds or 3 seconds. Yes, our power button is on, that is display is on. Within a 3 or a 5 seconds, we can able to get a two different uh, view of the monitor. That is one thing for a waveform and another thing for numerical values. Here, uh, yes, this is the display form and this is the left side. Well, the left side is nothing but indicate our waveforms of all the vital parameters. Uh, ECG waveform, then SBO2 waveforms, then blood pressure waveform, all the thing. And on the right side we have a... Uh, a display button called the numerical values that is a temperature numerical value then the BP numerical value and then a pulse rate numerical value. all the numerical values will be displayed in the right side view and the left side view we have a waveforms view all the waveforms will be displayed over in the left side view so this is the waveform display and the numerical display of the patient monitoring system especially through this we can able to identify the normal conditions of the patients that is patient conditions of 
uh, whether it is abnormal or normal we can able to use so these are all the parts and functions of so that's all about the part one video of patient monitoring system hope so you you just uh, have a clear note of what are all the parts present in a patient monitoring system so in the next video we are going to see the part two patient monitoring system in that we are going to see what are all the probes used in the patient monitoring system thank you